Easton Corbin was more than happy to roll with it Saturday at WIRK's Rib Roundup at the Cruise and Amphitheater. We were in Canada for uh, probably a month, first part of January. And, uh, Who planned that? I know. <laughs> I, I got to talk to somebody. And, you know, they're in the Midwest uh, all last month, so. Uh, this is like the first day we've had some sunshine in a long time. Easton grew up in a small town outside of Gainesville on his grandparents' farm. And though he's an award-winning country music star, he still enjoys the simpler things in life. What's your favorite food? Like, what do you crave the most? Like, maybe it's like mom's home cookie that you yeah. can't wait to get you know, home to. I, sometimes it changes. Today, I, I'm down in Florida. I'm, I'm craving seafood. I just love good old fried shrimp. I'm just no redneck from Florida. I, you know, I love... <laughs> Anything fried's good, but I love fried shrimp. What about fried catfish? That's what I grew up hey, on. I'll take fried catfish. <laughs> so what's something that people really don't know about you? Uh, you know, I'm, I'm kind of a history nerd. I like history. Okay. Yeah. Um, so give me some history facts, some fun oh, facts. Oh, uh, I'm going to put you on the spot if you're I, a history uh, nerd. Well, let's see. Well, I know the Civil War started in, I don't know, like, <laughs> see once. I don't like, think I don't he's know. really a history I, nerd. I think he's a lot. No, I, I, re I, I swear <laughs> I love it. I just, you know, I get a little nervous when I get put on the spot. Oh, know? I did a fact check, and Easton was right. The Civil War indeed started in 1861, and his love for the past maybe is a reflection upon why he still listens to the classics. My three favorite artists of all time and, and my heroes is Merle Haggard, George Jones, and Keith Whitley. I, you know, I, I just love, love that traditional country music. Though much has changed since these greats were producing music, one thing has stayed a staple in country music. This format is, you know, the, the fans are very close to what we do and, and uh, you know, they're always involved. You know, country music's uh, the only genre that has a, uh, a festival dedicated solely to its fans and, and, and that's a big deal because, you know, we wouldn't be out here if it weren't for those guys. And uh, so I'm just, uh, I feel really special and blessed to be out here and have a lot of fans. And good news, Corbin Country fans. Well, I got a new single that we just come out with. Uh, it's a song called Clockwork, and uh, you know, I'm very, very excited about it. And, of course, that's coming off of a, a brand new project that uh, actually just finished up this week, and um, hopefully it'll be out you know, early fall. You can get his latest single, Clockwork, now on iTunes. Rachel Lee, Fox 29.